local doggy day camp shut down over canine influenza. PetSmart in Mason says it expects to reopen its pet hotel and doggy day camp tomorrow after 72 hours of a, a disinfection process. WLWT News 5's Emily Wood spoke with a local veterinarian about the dog flu and what pet owners should be watching out for. Em. Mike, the dog flu has similar symptoms as the human flu, coughing, fatigue, lack of energy, and it is highly contagious. Veterinarians recommend isolation from other dogs and warn it can be fatal, but those cases are very rare. Right. Dr. Joey Brandstetter is treating six-month-old Finley with antibiotics for a respiratory illness, but says he has not had any confirmed cases of canine influenza at Misty Vista's pet hospital. Essentially, all dogs that are exposed to it do get the virus. Whether they show signs or not, they'd be carriers of it. Finley, you showing off. Finley's owner, Amy Zimberry, first heard about dog flu during a trip to this PetSmart in Mason, also home to Banfield Pet Hospital. Both companies confirmed to WLWT there have been several confirmed cases of canine influenza, and PetSmart began a rigorous 72 hour disinfecting process and expects to reopen the Pets Hotel and Doggy Day Camp tomorrow. So I'm definitely going to keep her away from other dogs for a period of 10 days. I know that it is actually more alert, um, contagious. At before the onset of everything coming on. And according to her vet, keeping Finley in isolation is one of the best things that Barry can do. I would stay away from areas that are highly concentrated, high population of dogs, dog parks, if possible, staying away from kennels. So if your dog shows symptoms, Dr. Brandstetter recommends using caution and calling your vet before taking them out in public. Now, the dog flu, very similar to many viruses, it can incubate up to four days before showing symptoms. So your pet might not show those symptoms right away if they are exposed. Mike. All right, Emily, live for us tonight. Thank you. There is a vaccine for the dog flu, but it only lessens the severity of the virus. It does not prevent it.